you know what we're about to do? Not five bets in five minutes. That's coming in about 40 seconds, maybe less. You're going to hit the thumbs up button. You're going to subscribe. You're going to have a blast here on the Odd Jopper channel. Oh, I'm going to tell you about the Discord. I'm going to make you money on DraftKings as well. Let's see here. I, I want you to just take your own temperature. Take your own test here, okay? Because I would bet that the majority of individuals here who watch the NFL, anywhere from 20 years old to 33 and a half, have no idea who this guy is and have no idea who the guy currently playing quarterback is. That's it. That's it. Five bets in five minutes. I'm telling you, you have no idea. 49ers fans don't know who the hell this guy is. He's not walking through that door, folks. Five bets in five minutes starts right now. Let us begin with the side, shall we? The Philadelphia Eagles, my goodness. I mean, really? They're only laying two and a half here. Well, take them on the money line. Why? We don't need to. 14% of games that we see played finish with a margin of victory at three points. That's the number one key number. Then you have key numbers of six, of seven. Yeah, it gets to four and ten, although 14 is up there before the other one. Notice what's not there. Two, one. You are covered here for a spread with the Philadelphia Eagles as the home favorite, essentially in a money line play less than two. We get beat and burned in the rear. We get beat and burned in the rear. It is unfortunate, but that is the way in which we take it. The Eagles are in a very fortunate spot right now being the home team in a championship game, and, and that has just benefited the home team exponentially. Now, let's keep it moving. Under 46.5 is the total here for the Niners and the Eagles. Why are we going under this total? Because we think – Essentially here, with all the firepower that is for the Philadelphia Eagles offense and what we've seen surrounding Brock Purdy. By the way, Niners fans, that's that's the guy. NFL fans, that's the guy's name, Brock Purdy. There's going to be a concerted effort for the Philadelphia Eagles to harass and force pressure, bad throws with Brock Purdy. And the Niners defense, especially on the ground, is as good if not better than anything the Eagles have seen. It's not just going to be sit back and throw the football as loud and as far as you possibly can. You're actually going to have to go out there and earn your money. Speaking of earning your money, as an Eagles fan, let me say that I am disappointed and I am upset, and I would like to know who to blame for this. Who the fuck woke George Kittle up? This guy was sleeping peacefully, hibernating, just, just sleeping, chilling, and then all of a sudden somebody poked that bear, and he's on an absolute tear right off. Uh, Freaking tear. tear. Did you hear the emphasis in that? Tear. George Kittle is Brock Purdy's best friend. And then some, by the way, George Kittle plays the lone position that seems to really frustrate the Eagles defense exponentially a couple of times over. Give me George Kittle on an anytime touchdown. You want to stretch it? You want to stretch it? We're going to get back to the big play coming up in a sec. As far as Brock Purdy is concerned, I don't think it's going to look that Purdy to, I couldn't. And I didn't even finish the analogy. We're going to go over an interception at minus 135. Now, this isn't Dak where it's like, oh, he's going to throw, he's going to throw. Pay whatever cost you can. There is, again, you're going up against four guys, four guys that have double-digit sacks on the Eagles defensive line. I know you have an all-world, all-pro, all-universe left tackle. You have a great offensive line. But this is not scheme. This is not week to week creating new stuff. This is not like pulling shit out of the hat. This is four individual men winning one on one battles, or in some cases, one on two battles. It's disgusting if you're watching this and you're not a fan of the Philadelphia Eagles. And Brock Purdy's going <laughs> to cough that sucker up. It's not going to be pretty. It's not going to look nice. But I want to be on the winning side of Brock, even if it's a tipped ball or if it's getting hit as he's throwing all of these things. Come on. You know what's going to be there. Hey, by the way, speaking of the playoffs, every now and again, you get something, someone, someone in on a team that isn't the number one option, that it, really this guy, I mean, first touchdown, all these things, people that you not, you're not betting on, that you're not counting on for doing a lot. I don't want to get burned there either, all right? Last play in the fifth minute is going to be Quez, Q, Q dub up in the air, in the house, to the end zone. See ya. 
Bye, Quez. Bye. Look, the Eagles defense, we know, is going to force a lot of pressure and maybe even a turnover, too, on the Niners offense. How about the other side of that? Jalen Hurts is going to have to throw. And it's not just going to be A.J. Brown. It's not just going to be Devontae Smith. It's not just going to be Dallas Goddard. There's going to be options for Quez Watkins to go up and in the red zone. That's another sneaky spot there. Bang. Five bets, five minutes. There you have it. Let me tell you about our Discord on the way up. All right? Our Discord. This final day. This is it. Final day for you. And I want you to join right now. This is an example. This is it. Final. You, you're going to lose the first week. Use the code ES Insider. First week is free. And this is an example. We gave these futures out January 11th. January 11th. Okay. We told you instead of betting either team to make it to the Super Bowl or even win the Super Bowl, bet these guys individually to lead the playoffs in rushing. Solo backs, they have a chance to play three games, then the Super Bowl, right? So we looked at that. This, These are Discord hits. These are di not yet, but these are Discord plays. Look at where we are right now. ETN is out. Saquon Barkley is out. Kenny Gainwell ain't getting the rock like that again, especially not in a blowout. Tony Pollard, Daniel Jones, all out. Pacheco's in there. Sanders is in there. But we have the top two guys that are currently in existence here. And this is an example, ladies and gentlemen, of the Discord. ES Insider, your first week is free. Okay? Now, in order to take advantage of this, you have to be 21 or older. You have to put $5 in on DraftKings. If you have a gambling problem, call 1-800-GAMBLER. Click that link below. Scan that QR code. It's going to take you 90 seconds, 90 seconds. And then place a wager on anything. Put a $5 bet on the Chiefs, all right? Take advantage of that. And instantly, as soon as you place the bet, 200 right back into your account. Take advantage of that. Go Birds.